All right, in this video, we're going to talk about hints and tricks to learn the top 200 drugs. Now, this isn't going to necessarily work for all of them, but this definitely will work for most of them. The three different areas that we're going to cover today is going to be the drug classifications, the hints, and we'll just give you a quick example of what it means so you understand it better, so you can put it all together. So the drug classification, this is going to be your penicillins, your antivirals, your cephalosporins, and then all these ones. These are going to be your major drug classifications. The hints that are going to help with these is going to be all the drugs ending in psyllin is going to be penicillins. All the drugs ending in ver is going to be an antiviral. Ceph, there's two different spellings for that one, but that's going to be your cephalosporins. Your statins are going to be your HMG CUA reductase inhibitor. Pril is going to be your ACE inhibitor. Alol is going to be your beta blockers. PAM or LAM is going to be your benzodiazepines. SON is going to be your adrenal cortical steroids. Triptan is going to be your anti migraine. Cetron is going to be your anti nausea. Sartin is going to be your angiotensin II antagonist. Prozol is your proton pump inhibitor. Zosin is your alpha blocker, Ida is your diuretics, COX-2 inhibitors is your COXIB, and Profen is going to be your non-steroidal anti-inflammatory. So a few examples of this is going to be for psyllin, amoxicillin. So whenever you see a drug ending in psyllin, you'll say, okay, well, hey, I know that's going to be penicillin. Now, this is going to help for the, for the reactions because, you know, if they're given four different medications for psyllins, you can say, okay, well, that might be a little weird. So we're going to go ahead and check that. So that's going to help with drug interactions. Femciclovir, that's going to be your antiviral. Cephaclor is going to be your ceph. So it's, see the second spelling right there. So it's going to be your cephalosporins. Pravastatin is your HMG COA reductase inhibitor, and so on and so forth. And I know it might be hard to follow along, but so what I went ahead and I did is I drew lines. So there's going to be lines to help you connect them. I would do your best to memorize these because it'll definitely help you with the drug interactions. It'll definitely help you identify which drugs are which. And so that's all for this video. And make sure you like the video and go ahead and subscribe so you can get more future updates about the pharmacy technician exam.